And, and you're in the star camp. I know. Like all around, full 360, oh, 360. It's right. an honor to be here. Thank, Thank you for, you for the here. good work that yeah, everybody's doing tonight. We're so grateful for all the sponsors, the donors. We had a lot of people that came together to, you know, donate their services, their time, and like, I just can't believe it. It feels like a dream, honestly. I want a hundred years from now, I want somebody to open a book and say, what was cancer? I, I'm reading about this thing called cancer. And they'll say, well, it was this terrible thing that took so many people, but they cured it. They cured it. And that's what you're doing tonight. What brings you here tonight? I have had a troop of people, a village of people helping me. And that's why I'm here tonight. I believe it's a great cause. And unfortunately, my mother died of cancer. We're here for a lot of different people that are fighting, that we are remembering. Fortunately, it impacts everybody, every family, um, one that's very close to our hearts. It touches everybody. I mean, right. there's nobody that escapes it. I've seen all signs of cancer. I'm a cancer survivor yeah. and a proud member of the board. It means a lot because cancer touches everyone's family. It right. touches mine personally. I've experienced it firsthand, and I just want to support anyone that is going through it or has gone through it. The value. The value. Nobody can yes. understand until they live it. Yes. Right. You can do an amazing job at your job, and until yep. you live it, right. something yeah. special I now. I think that message will come out loud tonight. I'm sure. I was noticing on the ride up, even when the rain, there was a bright sky. And I think yes. it's a perfect symbol, right? Tears shed and unshed, there's always hope. So tonight, that's what we're celebrating. We appreciate being a part. Yes. You know? yeah. I just love coming to see all of our people. I love to see the people that come out to support our cause, our mission. I just really, really enjoy seeing all our people here. There's really no amount of money that we would not give for you. $10,000 in honor of our dear friend, Jeannie Walsh. Cancer does not discriminate. It doesn't matter who you are. It doesn't matter whether you're the boss or the secretary. When it hits you, it hits you hard. When you experience cancer yourself, it's a whole different perspective. I think it's so telling, you know, from where you started to where you are now. There are so many people that want to support ACS and its mission here in the Capital Region, and it is. It's just so inspirational, and I think it gives everybody here so much hope for what ACS can do in the capital region and I'm just so proud to be part of it. It always takes you blind sides you and you see from Jeannie and all the people that are here it goes two ways she gained right. support from the community and the community gained inspiration from her. I am so thankful that I'm healthy I'm happy and I'm present here this evening. I'm extremely humbled and honored to accept the Beacon of Hope Award. What a privilege it is for me to be part of this team of people. When I saw everyone's names, I'm like, I don't belong in this group, but maybe I do. Um, you know, it seems so surreal that I'm being honored by the American Cancer Society. I feel like I'm in a lifetime movie. I really do. Thank you. The fun, the camaraderie, and just really coming in together for a good cause. The fact is that nobody here in this room goes through life without pain, but it's how you face that pain. This is why the American Cancer Society is here. 